Hey, how's it going everybody? So I got my roof fixed and the side of my house fixed from the storm where the tree fell on it. That's in another video. And uh, they got pretty much cleaned up, but I have been finding nails everywhere. So I decided to buy this. It's a Nico 36 inch heavy duty magnetic pickup sweeper. Hi little kitty. This is for uh, pushing around your yard and uh, has a quick release handle for dropping the stuff it picks up. So, just got it dropped off from, uh, ordered it on Amazon. I'm hoping it's all here because the whole end of the box is uh, tore open. So, open it up and find out what's inside. I barely had to hit that tape with the putty knife to open it. Okay, so the whole end of the box is ripped out in this thing. Inside we got a pair of nice rubber tires. And it looks like the handle's missing. Unless it's inside of it somewhere. Oh wait, I think it's stuck to the back there. Okay, so we got a nice heavy metal handle. It's heavier duty than I thought it would be. And then the magnetic pickup itself. So I'm going to go ahead and put this together and we'll try it out see how it works. Assembly is real easy. You just take these uh, nuts off the end, slide the tire onto the shaft, Screw the nut back on. I'm gonna go get my uh, wrench and uh, tighten that up and put the other one on. Okay, so when you're putting these on, there's no washers or any spacers or anything like that. The uh, wheel itself has like a nut there for a spacer with the uh, plastic wheel. When you tighten these down, don't over tighten them because you want your wheel to be able to turn freely. And if you tighten that down too tight, then the wheel's not going to turn. This handle here is so after you pick up stuff with it, you can uh, lift this and it lifts the magnet away from the metal at the bottom. And the stuff should drop off of the uh, bottom of the thing. And it looks to me like you do have one screw here to uh, put the handle on, which is the wing nut. So I'll put the handle on now. Okay, I got the wing nut tightened as much as I could, but uh, the, uh, it's still wobbly here. Uh, they really should have put two, two bolts in there to uh, hold that handle on, because this is going to be all wobbly. So I will probably drill another hole through there and put a second bolt in it so that it's stable. Also, the... Uh, the bolt has a little square thing, but it doesn't crank down and hold it tight. But, I mean, it's good enough to use the way it is. It's just, I don't like my stuff wobbly. It also has this adjustment nut on the side, so that you can adjust uh, the height of the handle to make it more comfortable for you to use. All right, let's go try it out. So before I got this, I uh, used my... my uh, hand magnet to uh, pick up a lot of nails. There's just tons of nails laying everywhere after a roofing job. So this is how you do it. You just uh, push it along. I can hear it picking up stuff already. We're just going to go a little distance here and then we'll turn it over and see how the bomb looks. This is just in the driveway but you can go through grass. I'm thinking. 
I guess if it was flat, you could. I'm just going to run it back and forth here on it. It's a little bit of a hill, hill right here. So it might be catching on the hill. Yeah, once you're on the flat yard, it works fine. So we'll just run over here. This is a 36 inch uh, width on this. So I'm going to go over the top of where I went just a little bit to make sure I don't miss anything. You can hear it picking up the nails. It'll click. All right. Let's just get down here. And let's flip it over and see how it did, just on that little bit. Well, when I laid it down, it dropped everything it picked up. So that might be an issue if I... If I got all the ones I just picked up out of the yard. When you... All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and run it around back to the sidewalk then. I can still hear it picking stuff up. Grass is a little thick right there. It really doesn't have a lot of clearance, of course. So if you got bumps, then gonna bottom out on them. All right, let's stop right here on this concrete and lift it up and roll it back. So here's everything I found in that little short area we went through. quite a few picked up all kinds of stuff staples all these roofing nails so yeah pretty good well I got a lot more yard and driveway to go over but what did it get one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 12 roofing nails so there's 12 less chances of me getting a flat tire in my mower or my truck well I hope you enjoyed this video of uh, me unboxing my new uh, magnetic rolling pickup thing so if you uh, want to check one out for yourselves I got this one on Amazon I'll put a link in uh, down in the description and uh, there you can see my new roof over my shoulder. I'm getting my chimneys both retopped. There's the garage roof. I'm getting both my chimneys retopped in a week or two. So then I'll be pretty much done with the uh, fixing up the house. All right. Thanks a lot for watching. Like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And I'll see you later.